guys, today we're gonna play some Minecraft. In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys the ultimate Skog Sensor Trap. So without further ado, let's get into the video. By the way guys, sorry this video is a whole day late, I felt really unwell so I just decided to postpone it. Alright guys, so uh, imagine I'm the person that you want to kill, uh, or you want to trap or whatever, uh, so for example like your friend, uh, and um, you put this trap in front of his base, they just run up here. That's the last thing they hear before. All right, and while we're here, I'll just quickly show you how it works. Here we have furnaces, so immovable objects. Here we just have two pistons timed two ticks apart. And here we have a piston pushing it up. Here we have two torches, and behind this, we have this cock sensor, of course, R around it we have wool, so oh, it's this trap is directional. So if, for example, you want someone going from here to there, then you should place this cock sensor here, and the whole, whole build will be rotated 90 degrees. But that's enough talking, let's see the build in this nice... Uh, Top down view, as I said, clock sensor, wall around important. This needs to be wall, and this needs to be wall. That's basically it. So, I'm gonna stop chatting and just let's get into the build. These are the items that you need the top two sections here are for the actual, like trapdoor and this is for the skulk sensor part we'll start things off by going three blocks up one two three breaking the bottom two here we place redstone two redstone torches on the sides like so here we have obsidian then you place a temporary block go out from both sides here then take two of the slabs like so redstone redstone Repeater set to two ticks on both sides. So that's one click or two ticks. Obsidian placed here and here like so. Now we take a temporary block and make an L shape. Break the temporary block. Place two redstone dust here. Actually, let's make that a slab. Again, repeater set to two ticks or one click. And we've got normal wall repeat that on the other side and you've got the mechanism done now we need the sticky pistons here and here and another sticky piston here and here and two last sticky pistons here and here now we'll place make an L shape out of honey like so and fill in the other part with slime. Now we take the grass block. And this button here is for testing. Works perfectly, am I right? Here at the back we need the furnaces. So make a two by three wall here and extend three blocks from each side. Like so, test if it still works. Now, let's take the stuff for the skulk sensor. So, we place a temporary block, place a block here, place a temporary block, and go around it, break this block, redstone repeater here, set to four ticky twos. <laughs> <laughs> and 
and the now and it's also foolproof so like see I am powering it on and off but it still works perfectly okay guys I really do hope that you enjoyed this video it was a ton of fun to make again I'm sorry that I couldn't put this video out yesterday I just really felt bad but anyway guys I will see you in the next one bye bye